Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we are going to multiply these given numbers 18 times 19 times 20 times 21 times 22 and we are not supposed to be using calculators of any kind. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up to this video. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we can do. Let's go ahead and manipulate these number. If I call this middle number 20 as an x, so that means let's say that x equal to 20, then this number is going to become x minus 1. This number is going to become x minus 2. On the other end, this number is going to become x plus 1 and this number is going to become x plus 2. So therefore, I wrote down 20 as an x, 19 as x minus 1, 18 as x minus 2, and here 21 as x plus 1, and 22 as x plus 2. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and rearrange these numbers. I am going to put x minus 1 and x plus 1 together and likewise x minus 2 and x plus 2 together. So therefore I can write it as x and then times x minus 1 times x plus 1 and likewise x minus 2 times x plus 2. And now let's focus on these two factors, x minus 1 and x plus 1. We are going to use this formula. So therefore, this part could be written as x square minus 1 square, which is same as x square minus 1 square is same as 1. And likewise, let's focus on this part over here, these two factors x minus 2 times x plus 2, we are going to use this formula once again. So this could be written as x square minus 2 square, which is same as x square minus 4. So therefore, we can write this one as x times x square minus 1 times x square minus 4. Four. And now let's focus on these two factors. And here I have copied them down. And now let's go ahead and do the double distribution. And then we're going to multiply them. So this is going to become x power 4 minus 4x square minus 1x square and then plus 4. Let's combine the like terms. x power 4 and this is going to give us negative 5x squared plus 4. So therefore, we can write this one as x times x power 4 minus 5x squared plus 4. And now we know that our x value is 20, so wherever we see x, I am going to replace each of these one by 20. So therefore I can write this one as 20 times this is 20 and then power 4 minus 5 times 20 and then square and then plus 4 and now we are going to simplify this. And now let's focus on this part 20 power 4. And here I have copied it down 20 power 4. And now this 20 could be written as 2 times 10. And then I just uh, separated them. So this could be written as 2 power 4 times 10 power 4. 2 power 4 is same as 16. And 10 power 4 means we are going to put uh, 4 zeros. And if we multiply them, we are going to get 16 with the 4 zeros. So therefore, we can write this one 20 outside the bracket 
and this could be written as 160,000 and then minus 5 times this 20 square is same as 20 times 20 is 400 and then plus 4 and now in this next step 5 times 400 is going to give us 2000 and now let's focus on these numbers inside this bracket and here I have copied them down and we can see that 160,000 minus 2000 is going to give us 158,000 and then plus 4. So they add up to 158,004. Now let's focus on these numbers and here I have copied them down and now I have broken down this 20 into 10 times 2 and then I multiplied 2 times this number 158,004 and that gave us 316,008 and finally I multiplied this number by 10 so we got 3,160,080 so thus we got our answer as 3,160,080 thousand and then 80 and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye